Hey guys, walking here, exploring a swamp in Minecraft Beta 1.9 pre-release. Um, apparently swamps are now swampier, according to the uh, release notes I read. Um, as you can see here, there's uh, some different coloring. The grass looks a little different here. Uh, the water, actually, is kind of greenish, like nasty looking, so I guess that's kind of swampy. Um, there's also some... a little instant with a creeper here a little bit ago. <laughs> There's also apparently lily pads somewhere. Oh, there we are. Lily pads. Oh. Which, uh, don't actually have an item description. But, can I actually... What do I do with it? I don't know what to do with it. Doesn't look like I can do anything with it. Well, I have one, at least. Um, but yeah, swamps do, uh, they have a little swampier feel. Um, vines are still present. Which, can harvest here with shears. And also got part of that tree, which you can also do with shears. And throw that there. And then put a vine on the side of it. Yay! <laughs> so anyways, that's that. Um, not too much going on for the swamp. I, uh, I figured out what some of the, what this was, this unnamed item, it is a gold nugget. Um, if you take gold nuggets, uh, if you didn't see my last video, go watch, I'd pick one of these up and I didn't exactly know what it was. Um, if you take gold nuggets and put them nine, you get a gold ingot drop from uh, pigmen in the nether, so um, another way to get gold, pretty much indefinitely, I guess, because pigmen spawn... Um, infinitely. Uh, pigmen no longer drop rotten, or no longer drop rotten, they drop uh, rotten flesh rather than uh, uh, cooked pork chops, which kind of sucks, because I would uh, frequent the nether uh, just to get food, because it's really easy. You don't have to cook it, you just got to go in and slay things, they can all run to you as soon as you aggro one. So I, I'm kind of not too enthused about that. Um, also going to try to melt a snowman here. Let's see, they're supposed to melt in warmer environments. I figure a swamp's pretty warm. Well, he's spreading snow. It's not exactly melting. Let's make a couple of these. But, uh, like I said, they're supposed to melt in warmer environments, but doesn't really seem to be melting too much. Let's see here. Well, if you ever want to change an area to snow, just throw up a bunch of snowmen. Good grief. Don't really seem to be melting, though. Um, well, maybe that's not done yet. Uh, no big deal there. But I'm going to let them just go to town on <laughs> this swamp area. I don't like the swamp anyway. I prefer snow. Um, vines have different colors as well. Let's see here. Um, I think that's about it for the, the swamp changes, to be honest with you. I don't think there was a whole lot, mostly aesthetics, not, uh, actual game-changing things here. Um, so anyways, that's it for this video. A little bit short, but it's not much to cover. So, uh, until next time. Later. So I was getting a, um, a look at the swamp from the air, and, uh, it actually is quite a bit um, swampier. My snowman over there going nuts. Um, as you can see, the water's all really dingy looking. Um, and you, you really notice when you compare it to a non-swamp. I mean, water color is significantly different. And even the uh, along the line here, the uh, colors will change. So, anyways, it just kind of looked uh, quite a bit better from above. So I thought I'd, I'd tack this on the end. Um, so until next time, later.